welcome back to the unboxers and today we have for you something new called doodads check it out so this is a little figure that you make out of beads and it looks like some sort of string or something that holds it together I guess we'll find out when we open it up but these are an Alex DIY product and we want to say a great big thank you to Alex Brands for sending this to us to share with you. We're very excited to make this do that. Yes. <laughs> I love the name of them. Make them and mix them. So there are other kinds you can get as well. It tells you exactly which one you're going to get up here. So this is Sprinkles and we're going to build this look. She's mint chocolate chip, my favorite. Oh, yeah. And she's got sprinkles all over her, which is my favorite ice cream topping. So we have also, um, it looks like, is that Celeste? Celeste, yeah. Celeste, the uni, the uni, Gloria. Oh, is she like a soccer player, looks like? Uh, possibly. She looks like she's got a soccer ball on her head. Um, we have Punky, Sprinkles, and Burgadette. Oh Burgadette. my goodness. Hilarious. Oh, I definitely would like to get Burgadette and Uni. But all of them look really awesome. I like Celeste's colors as well. All right, so it says that you put it together, like it shows you, make it, link it. Oh, look at that. Oh, maybe The I little guess hands have, linked have together. Must. Some magnets or something. Yeah. And then take it. So it shows you hanging it on your backpack. So here's all. It has 24 pieces inside. It shows you here's the 24 pieces you get. And it looks like there's a little string and the clasp. So um, I guess go ahead and open it up so we can show the pieces inside. And then we'll come back and show you how it's done. You need some scissors? Nope, oh, got it. All right. That was easy enough. So we have our instructions. And there we go. So it shows you step by step um, how to build your DIY doodad. Look at that. And here's, of course, another. Um, display of oh there you go there so there are all your pieces isn't that cute <laughs> oh my goodness there's a little face and here's of course the other ones that you can get that you can make up look at the little unicorn that's cool super cool so we're going to go ahead and get these pieces out of the bag and start assembling and come back and show you what she looks like we'll be right back Hey, if you're enjoying this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that bell to get the notifications so you can see more awesome unboxer fun. Okay, so we have our doodat started um, just for time's sake, but it is super simple. We'll show you. Um, oh, her little face is stuck inside her hair. There we go. So you get this um, little rubbery, it's like a string thing, but it's rubbery, which makes it really cool. You um, fold it in half and put it around this part like it shows in the direction so one half goes over this and then you feed those two things through the top of the let me show you Oop, through the top of that one and then through the top of the head it has a little slot you do them individually mm -hmm. one at a time it has the little thing that slides through there and stays very cool this is called the no knot system right mm. Yes. Because there are no knots. No knots. Okay. And then you're going to have this little um, neck piece. And it looks like it fits inside of here. I'm trying to figure out. And then I'm guessing these two pieces will go through here. Through this. Let me see how. Okay. There we go. So we got them through that. That's her little neck piece. And uh, then she's going to have... Uh, I guess if you build her, then you can do her arms after that. She's going to yeah, need this little cherry piece. Yeah. Do the middle first, you're saying? I think so. And then you can All right. and then hopefully her ice cream. get that part to stay together. Yeah. Because that part will be, will be done. And you feed it through the little top of the ice cream. Oh, she's so cute. And then it looks like um, two on each leg, you think? Yeah, I think. All right. I'll hold them out. Let's see what we can do here. We might have to put, okay, put the boot on so we can be done. Okay, and then that's it, yeah, right? that that's it. And so and the boot hooks on the bottom. Okay, so what you do is you take the little stretchy thing, you stretch it through here like this. It looks like through the back of the boot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then it will looks like it's supposed to stay right just mm -hmm. like that okay 
she looks like she's missing something. Are her legs coming down? I think it just gives you it gives something you meant to go all the way up to the top. This is true. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now we're gonna do her other leg. Need some more room here. Okay. So another white one, another white one, and this one would be really cute. So their hands are not magnetic. They clasp together. Yeah. Um, like a interlocking system. So we were if wrong the about the magnets. Fits. If the boot fits. <laughs> so you strap, you pull this um, rubber piece through here. It goes right through her boot. And then there she is. Really cute. Look at that. Now uh, she needs some arms. What? Did I do it right? Yeah, but this. But that's, I think that's at the end. Well, these, these little things uh -huh. hold, like you put it like it's a stopper. So it doesn't slide up and down the strip. Okay. So you put one at the oh, top. Oh, at the to top. Okay. Alrighty. So let's get her arms assembled. She's going to need a pink and a turquoise and then the brown, right? Okay. So hopefully you can see this. A pink, a turquoise, and a brown. Oops. So this is her little hand piece. And it's going to be kind of like the boot. You're going to feed it through there. But make it, make it. It has to be open out. on the end, yeah. yeah. There we go. Ta-da! See, so you don't need to knot it at all. And now we're going to do her other arm. Okay, hand me the pink. Pink. And teal. And there we go, the brown. I'm going to slip it. You see it has a slit just like the boot. I'm hoping you're seeing it and not my fingers. Uh-oh. Hold on. I need John's. Okay, there we go. And we're going to slip it through here like this. So it has the little groove like that. Very easy. Okay, now, oh. once you get her... I think what you have to do is slide it up. Oh, slide it up. Which way? Which like the whole, the whole, whole girl. Well, she doesn't slide up but so much. I know what you want. Basically, what you're trying to do is you're trying to put one of these under the skirt. Oh, hold. under the skirt. Okay. I didn't know where you were aiming for. Okay. Like to, like, to the hold her legs together. together. Yeah. Okay. Okay. There we go. Oh, it's not. Is it brown both of them? Yeah, see how it's yeah. got like a... Okay, so it's got this little stopper piece. All right, and then we're going to put one at the top. You do one on your head. Right there. You put it through both. Ta -da! So that's our little stopper piece. So there she is. Oh my goodness, let me see if I can get her without so much shadow. Very cool. There she is. Now she's in the light. Let me put her down here. Let's fix her boots. You want to fix her boots up? There we go. I knocked the camera all crazy. There she is. <laughs> Look at her. She's so cute, and that was super fast, and we didn't have to tie any knots. Nope. So that's really cool, especially to teach um, kids those fine motor skills and the string beads, and you don't have to be tying a knot and all that kind yeah. of business. 24 pieces, but it was really easy to assemble. I love the little doodads. And in a second, we had our, in a few minutes, we had our awesome little doodad, little sprinkles, and uh, I think that Burgadette is the next one I yeah. have to add to this collection. Super cool. Yeah, that one looks really cool. That is really cool and very easy to make. Very easy. I love the little um, rubber pieces and it seems like they thought of everything with this one. Mm -hmm. Super easy. So and that's why it's ages six plus. But probably some younger kids could do it as well with a little supervision. Yeah. Yeah. And I think um, that's um, probably they could do it by themselves. Yeah. All right. So thank you so much for watching. And we want to say another great big thank you to Alex Brand for sending this to us to share with you. And comment, like, subscribe, tell a friend. And we will see you next time. Spring.